Which of the following diagnostic tests should be performed to identify the underlying cause of his condition? Abdominal CT, echocardiogram, MR, magnetic resonance and geography of renal arteries, renal biopsy, or urine osmolality measurement. A 50-year-old man is being evaluated for difficult-to-control hypertension. He has no significant past medical history and takes no medications. Um, his physical examination reveals a blood pressure of 160 and no other abnormalities. La laboratory test shows hypokalemia, metabolic alkalosis, and an elevated plasma aldosterone concentration with suppressed renal suppressed plasma renin activity. Which of the following diagnostic tests should be performed next to identify the underlying cause of his condition. So I'm thinking it's just going to be an aldosterone secreting tumor, um, especially because he has difficult, difficulty um, secreting, difficulty controlling his hypertension. Okay. Um, that is made. Okay. I am beat. I don't think it's magnetic resonance of the angiography of renal arteries or the urine osmolality. So I'm going to get rid of those two. Um, echocardiogram. I don't believe that is it either. So I'm gonna. I believe between renal biopsy and abdominal CT, and I. I actually. Okay. So read the I'm, question again. Which of the following diagnostic tests should be performed to identify this underlying cause of this condition? Read it again. You missed a word. <laughs> Which of the following diagnostic tests should be performed next to identify the underlying cause of his condition? Yeah. So perform next. What do you want to do next? So this is a little bit step two-ish kind of question that's thrown in here, but th you know, I think you're on the right track. So which one do you want to perform first? Probably an abdominal CT, less invasive. Good, right? Because... Um, you're not going to want to do a um, biopsy without seeing where this thing is, right? <laughs> yeah, um, that makes sense. <laughs> yeah, right? So so you're going to want to see, right? Especially, you know, you more than likely it's an adrenal adenoma, right? But if you're talking about a renal biopsy, right, it's actually not what is going on here, right? Because the kidney itself is not going to be biopsied if you are going to do a biopsy at all, but you don't even need a biopsy to this, but you wouldn't biopsy the kidney, you'd biopsy the tumor inside the adrenal, right? That's what I was leaning towards anyway, but I was like making sure in my head, like, okay, yes, like a is made somewhere else, not made in the kidney, like anyway. Exactly. Yeah.